Yep, more Shadow of the Tomb Raider. This is the Path of Life puzzle. I don't know about you guys, but I had a lot of trouble with this one. I'm not sure what it is, but it's, it's not hard for most of it. It's just the last part that I struggled with. So we'll get to that, and that's when I'll kind of explain it. Basically, with this puzzle, it's pretty easy, at least at this point. Right now, all we have to do is turn these wheels. They'll automatically stop when we get on the picture that we actually need, say. You can see each one of these, they have a symbol across from you with those doors. We just need to match that symbol that's on there. This part is easy. In fact, the next part isn't too hard either. But while we're working on that, I'll explain what makes the last part of the puzzle difficult and what you actually need to do to solve it. So you got those locked in, you can just open these doors. You push them. Okay, so in each one of these, behind each one of these doors, there are two rows of symbols. Those are what we need to put on the, uh, the turning platform things. See, so as you can see, we've already matched the top ones for this, the top two. See that? That's the same. Go through this. And this is the same. And they're both where they they're both the same actually. There's parts that are missing, and I guess those are considered rubbed off. Cause like the left and the right ones here, they match up with the left and the right ones we have to input. So see how the bottom ones for all of them are rubbed off? That's kind of the hard part. And see now that we've opened both doors, we can open this one. But, oh, it doesn't work yet. You can see, it raised up again, so we have to input these. So this is easy, it's just the O here. See, so you can look at it right now. See how the left wheel, it corresponds with the uh, left row of symbols. And the right one corresponds with the right. So it's a dot, now it's three dots. Easy, right? Yeah, it's just the real issue here is the bottom ones which are both completely rubbed out, so when we get there, then it can be hard. I'll show you what the deal is with those when we get there, though. Same old stick. You open one door. There must be more to this. And then they get raised up back here, so we have to change them again. Once again, it's another O. Or like a coin, or a loaf of bread, or whatever you want to call it. And this one, see it's rubbed out on that side, but on the other side it shows it. It is this line. Alright, that did it. Before I see me run back and forth, so I'll just skip that now. Okay, so. Look down. You can barely make them out, but they're still there partially. See, you can see a circle there. And that one you can kind of see like a little part sticking out. So you can kind of make it out. So the one on the left is just another circle. Turn it. And the one on the right. Because we saw that circle. Yeah, you saw that like it was kind of close to the middle. So it's the two circles that align over it. It's for the one on the right. But that should solve it. 
There we go. That's probably one of the more difficult main story puzzles in the game. That's the path of life. This is Shadow the Tomb Raider. Thanks for watching.